This is the story about a king and his son who would pester him every day to give him his property. So to get rid of that problem, the king said, look son, I have this square piece of property or land and I will give you half of this the first day and then every subsequent day I will give you half of what you got before. So now the question is, how much land do you think the son eventually got after lots of days? And we can solve this by doing a geometric progression. But we can also do this series with just a piece of paper and by cutting it. Now cutting the square along a diagonal divides the square in two equal parts and it makes two triangles which are right angled isosceles triangles with two sides as the same. So the first day king divided his square in two equal parts. The first part would have the area as half of the original square. The next day he divided the remaining piece again in half and gave it back to his son. So the area of this thing will be one fourth of the original square because it is half of what was remaining. And again, he divided again into two equal parts. So this will be half of what was left, half of one fourth, which is one eighth. And you can see that by cutting in these equal parts, you result in all triangles that are similar to each other, which is they are all right angle triangles and the two other angles are 45 degrees. So they are in the same shape but different sizes. And so now dividing again in two parts he got half of 1 8 which is 1 16. And you can see that if he keeps on doing this what is remaining is small triangles. So the sun will never get the whole land but what the king will eventually give cannot be more than the original square. And so the sum of this series half one fourth, one eighth will be one. And you can perform the same experiment by cutting the square along the sides and you will get the same answer. This is the sum of the geometric series. So you can enjoy this interesting story about series and have fun with math.